How's it going ladies and gentlemen, Deeker Jones here and today I wanted to bring you a glitch that is not new by any means but is by far one of my favorites. I haven't covered it before because it's fairly minor and it doesn't actually gain you much benefit aside from a, some aesthetics. You're not going to get rich off of it, you're not going to get super powerful, but if you're like me and you hate having wires run all over your settlements then stick around because this glitch will solve a lot of your problems. So to get started with this glitch, what we're going to do is, as you can see out here in the corner of Sanctuary, I have set up a power bank of 10 large power generators that are all tied together. If I wanted to do it the proper way, I would have to create power pylons or conduits or whatever and run the cables up over ground all the way over to the places that I want to get power to but of course we're going to glitch so to start off with what you're going to want to do is set a power conduit one of the down face or the up facing ones that go on the ground right in front of one of your generators and then you're going to want to run a wire to it now let's go to the building that we would like to get power to so that we can get it set up and get ready for the glitch so I have have a light here on my house that is above my power armor right here. I just want a little light to, to light up my power armor. So what we're going to do is, is we're going to place a power conduit as low as we can possibly get it on the little house here and that sets us up to be able to do this glitch. So heading back out to our power generator. Now we want to run a wire off of this power conduit to the power conduit that we have there but of course Anybody that's tried to run long wires knows that you can't really do that. So, I don't know if you can see where my cursor is at, but right at the top of the PowerPoint, scroll up slightly just until the wire itself becomes targetable. And then you want to hit the Y button or whatever your Create Power Connection button is, and that's going to put an invisible wire on your cursor. You can't tell it right now, but I'm actually running a wire from that location to my house up here. So you come over to this power conduit and you make the connection. So now you can see there's only the slightest little bit of wire that is actually sticking up through the ground. I've got power to my little light bulb, so now my power armor is lit up. And if we trace this all the way back down to the power generator, you'll see that they're still white because I'm still glitched. So you'll want to hit cancel to get back into normal operating mode. But we come down here and you'll see that this little wire is run from this location all the way up to my house, one single wire, and it's all underground. And I can do this infinitely from this little point. Just run it to all the different locations that you want. So the big key to all of this is make yourself a little power generating station somewhere off in a remote portion of your settlement and ideally something at a lower elevation because it's the sag in the line that causes it to go underground. So if your power station is much higher up in elevation, the line is still going to sag down until the point where it starts to curve back up. So if your goal is to run it underground like I do, you want to get the lowest elevation you can find. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. You now have nice and tidy wires. And even if you wanted to, you could do the exact same thing from this point. This works with any uh, connection that you can attach a wire to. You would just come right here just as soon. And now you have an invisible wire that you could run to well, just for shits and giggles, let's put it up here and you'll see what I'm talking about. Now this wire is actually running through my little uh, shanty shack here, which is not ideal by any stretch of the imagination. But uh, yeah, it'll clip through anything. It doesn't care. Honey Badger, don't give a shit. So I hope you guys enjoyed that. Uh, if so, please leave a like, baby subscribe, and as always, I hope you guys have a very nice day.